Guys, what's up and welcome back to a fresh new inside series. I welcome you in front of me with the brand new Mercedes-Benz S-Class, the 2020-2021 model. In specific, the S500 AMG line. In this video, I will walk with you through all its features on the interior as well as the exterior. We have two models available. This is the AMG line and on the other side, we have the non-AMG line version. So this is your non-AMG line S-Class 2021 in high-tech silver. But if you look closely, you can see some differences. They're still distinct. I mean, it's still an S-Class. If we look closer to the side skirts, for example, you can see that they have change the side skirts for this model these are well yeah chromed out very distinct but still sticking out a little bit in compared to the amg line also for the wheels we have more classic wheels duo tone so we have chrome combined with that nice gloss black finishing pretty busy wheels a lot of going on but hey it keeps the car shape because the coloring of this chrome really combines nice with the high-tech silver the real party starts inside. Not with this beat though, but on the inside, this interior, I'm not kidding. The S-Class is known for its benchmark. And trust me, they've done it. It's again the benchmark. Okay, enough said, let's get rolling on the exterior. If you're here for the first time, please tap the subscribe button and the bell notification. And that way you won't miss any of my new videos. New S-Class, here we go. Let's start first all on the nose. So what do we see as first? Well, we see a very, very redesign on the whole front, especially that big grille sticking out a lot with the big sensors there in the center. And we can see we recognize the identity of the A-Class in the headlights. But <laughs> don't be confused, these headlights are next level. So let's have a look at the grill so we got gloss black with chrome in the center one big unit for all the centers we still got the double star here the mercedes-benz logo emblem and we got the front camera and yeah well, we got all these sensors because this car is full of technology it's the benchmark in its class to give you an idea how huge the new front grill is it's it's huge So this is the AMG line, so we got the most aggressive version of the S-Class. And then we go to the brand new headlights. So what do we have, how it's building up. So in the center, you got these LED beams. There you got your other lights. And here on top, you got your day driving light. And we got some blue finishing on the inside, on the interior of the headlight. And this is pretty insane because this is digital light now these days. So down here in the front bumper, well, pretty familiar for any Mercedes driver. The AMG line, pretty aggressive with those uh, front bumpers sticking out. We've got the lines and we got this shape all continuing to the front splitter. So we got one shape from the front splitter finishing here in the AMG bumper sensors all over the place of course like it used to be and compared to the amg line this is the front of the high-tech silver s class and then we can see like always we have a different kind of bumper finishing this is very classy very shaped naturally not very aggressive, very elegant. Still, we got a little front splitter here sticking out with two tones. Got some finishing in, well, black and chrome, two combinations. The 
crazy finishing of the new headlights with the digital lights also here. Let's have a look at these wheels. So what wheels have they designed for the S-Class AMG line? AMG branded, well, duo tone actually, because it's still some satin silver and inside we got metallic gunmetal gray. We got gray calipers, steel discs drilled. Very sporty wheels. This one has measures of 55, 35, 21 inch for the front. And then we have a look at the side. So for the AMG line, we have the AMG aggressive side skirts sticking out a lot, but not too much. I mean, not like a full AMG car, but still enough to give the whole elegant car a sporty look. The outside mirror, of course, equipped it with a camera Finished with gloss black and with that nice white paint, metallic paint. Then we have the door handles. We have new door handles, but look at this. They are very seamlessly designed. So how do you open the door? Well, you can go closer to your door handle or if you just open the car with the new key, by the way. This is the new S-Class key. So if you open the doors, the door handle automatically pops out. And on the door handle, you can see the Mercedes-Benz branding as well. So yeah, pretty firm, pretty big S-Class door handle. For this MG line they have used satin silver window trims, finishing all the way on the whole window trim of the car. This is the extended version so we have a long version you can clearly see that the rear doors are bigger than the passenger door and this one is just like the other one equipped it with the panoramic roof there we have probably the antenna very nice sticking out just a little bit but very integrated and very very aerodynamic Okay, let's have a look at the rear wheels. So we have P0 tires and the rear wheels have measures of, where are we? 285, 30, 21 inch. Okay, let's head on to the whole rear section of the new S-Class. So first of all, we have this, a total new redesign of the LEDs in the rear and if you look below you can see how they have designed that 3d layer of the rear lights so you can look inside the lights very easily very elegant and yeah this reminds me definitely of the CLS lights so for the AMG line we also have a different rear bumper low rear bumper here you can see a little rear diffuser and again the exhaust tips are integrated in the black finish of the rear diffuser gloss black by the way starting from there so if we go to the rear of the non-AMG line we still see those very nice shaped new rear LEDs reminds me a bit of the CLS by the way that angles those corners these are the exhaust tips of the non-AMG line very classic nice silver trim all the way to the rear side almost gives you a little bit of a rear diffuser feeling trunk space new s class uh, well okay this is uh, some private stuff but this is pretty big so we have a very very big trunk space it's electronically controlled there you go engine bay of the new S500 there we go we've got a six cylinder engine turbocharged so yeah what have they done well you can clearly see the engine is <laughs> huge 
This engine cover is huge. Here you can see the two air intakes where the air gets filtered and entering the chambers. It's time for the serious job. Let's get in. Okay, interior game. Benchmark. The S-Class. First of all, let's start on this door. So, adapt this for a moment. Because we have some serious changes here. First on the top, we got leather. Then we got here the new 4D sound system by Burmester, giving you 39 speaker units. Yes, 3, 9. 39 speaker units integrated in the whole interior. So let's continue. Then we got this active ambient lighting that's new for the first time ever. This, in compared to the normal ambient lighting over here. Then we got some diamond shaped stitching, red stitching. Here below again, red leather with the red stitching again. We got some gloss finishing here, gloss black. We got, of course, memory seats heated, also ventilated full memory seats we got new touch buttons to control the electric adjustable seats uh, let me demonstrate it if I lightly press this there you go if I just press it lightly back so the electric adjustable seats are very sensitive touch controlled by the new interface here door handle and this is sticking out and again ambient lighting here <laughs> so controls for the windows and for the rear sun shading. They have now repositioned the light switch in the doors where you can normally find it on the lower section here of the left side of the steering wheel. So light controls, of course, full automatic lights on the door here. And then down here we have another Burmester 40 speaker unit. By the way, this is red leather, by the way. So this is all red leather. Then down here we have black leather and again, door sill so before you enter you have these layers <laughs> so let's say one two three four so we have all, almost like if a very deep five layer indication but officially we have two layers so door sill enlightened mercedes-benz logo here and then you have the actual inside of the interior with also a nice metal brush finishing of the door sill the floor mats amg of course and then we have a new redesign of the seats Mercedes-Benz is known for one of the best seats. I can acknowledge that because I have driven almost 5,000 kilometers in a previous S Coupe. Those seats are insane. So we got red leather again in the seats. We got diamond shaped leather with that stitching as well. Very soft leather, so not too hard. Yeah. Entry test. <laughs> the seat is positioned very high. So you don't have an entry like in an SUV, but you still have a very comfortable access. Guys, this is very special. I welcome you inside the new Mercedes-Benz S-Class. In this S500 AMG line, this is your point of view. <laughs> the active ambient lighting combined with the normal ambient lighting, combined with the red letter, this is why the S-Class is always the benchmark in its level. Let's start on this left side. So what the hell is going on here? Let me tell you. So first of all, the light switch here on the left. Integrated in that new trim, and this trim is a metal weaven trim. So you can say that this is a carbon fiber process, but finished and replaced with metal fibers. So light switches here on the left. Here we got some contrasting vents in compared to the center vents very nice very elegant mercedes has used inspiration from yachts to finish this interior so in front of the driver we have the mbux screen for the driver very very high level screen very high resolution and let's put the amg screen on this there you go this is the amg screen Okay, steering wheel. Well, this steering wheel is classic combined with, I think this is black wood. It feels like black wood. In the center, we got some leather finishing. Here we got all the touch buttons for this MBUX screen. And on the right, you have the buttons for the center MBUX screen. And this is all finished 
and a nice trim in metal and gloss black with black leather so we got an all blacked out steering wheel even in the steering wheel we have controls very nice so they have integrated controls here in the steering wheel new shift pedals shift down shift up very wide pedals very nice finishing so behind the MBUX screen of the driver we have a very huge unit this is the unit for the heads-up display and the augmented reality so now you can't see it but the augmented reality will project arrows to the left or on the right where you should drive while driving and then to the right we have four vents very nice metal vents with a very nice finishing and these are all housed in leather there you go housed in leather with black stitching center speaker as well and also here on the passenger side you can see how that interior shape is continuing to the passenger side as well big start stop button here on the right side of the driver and by the way not to forget parking brake on the left side classic mercedes on the left side still on the left side and down here also this is all finished in leather everything that's red is leather there you go also down here in the glove box big glove box all finished in leather okay let's talk a quick a bit about the new mbux system because mercedes has taken for the s-class the benchmark in its level the mbux to a higher level so you got a lot of features more in case of well-being and also on safety for drivers as well as for persons around the car on the public road so we now have the options to put in four accounts this is just a basic account four accounts for every person so you have an account for your passenger for your rear passengers as well and in your account you can store all your personal items so this is the new MBUX screen very big very intuitive yeah this new MBUX is pretty crazy okay let me try to show you a bit of the color choices here there you go let's do blue so this is blue active ambient lighting blue this is red purple this is green there you go this is nuts this is nuts let's put it back to orange red wow yeah so also integrated in the speaker unit there we now have 10 programs for energizing comfort combinations with smell <laughs> with air conditioning even with seat massages that's nuts all right guys it's time to go to the rear section of the new s-class let's have a look at how the rear section feels and also how it looks like here we go rear section of the extended s500 first of all at the doors well the same as the front door but then bigger again those very nice layers of leather black leather with red leather we got the ambient lighting down here the active ambient lighting up here color choices <laughs> very very bright combining with the red leather we got the speaker units again the Burmester 40 audio so down here black leather again so yeah very very nice finishing then we got the door sills mercedes-benz and lighted again we got two layers and then the seat section well it's only one way to find out and that's to get in and when i get in whoa this feels very soft it's very soft leather so you can really feel that you can sit like for hours in this whole rear section so yeah guys i welcome you inside the rear section of the brand new s-class the rear section this is your point of view these seats are selected with the entertainment system so here we have the same mbux touchscreen as the front screen but then a bit smaller still all options mostly all options available here as the rear passenger what do we see here on top well the burmester audio speaker here again this handle in the roof is also finished in leather and then here in the center of the roof again one big speaker unit and then you have that finishing of the whole seat here all in leather by the way for the rear passengers we have two separate climate systems with nice two vents here and of course you also have heated and cooled seats for the rear passengers also a left vent down here 
very nice. Look at this button finish here. And this is the leg space. So yeah, the space in here is limousine level. So my leg space is huge, huge. And my head space as well. And I can, of course, change my whole seat position as well. Switch here is also enlightening because it's not engaged. Safety first. And then in the center armrest, we got a tablet. Here's some extra spaces. And down here, some optional stuff. And here on top, we got also ambient lighting with the same color choices and some leather finishing here as well. In the roof, we have Alcantara, it's a panoramic roof. Okay, guys, the brand new Mercedes Benz S Class, the 2020 model, 2021 the S500. I hope you have some more feeling on the exterior and maybe more important of the interior. Personally, I think the big change is on the interior. If I'm sitting in this car, I could be in a spaceship. Yeah, they really have set the new level. And as you might not know, the S-Class is always the benchmark for Mercedes-Benz. So all this technology will float down slowly in the upcoming years to all the other models. Don't forget to tap on the subscribe button, hit the bell notification so you won't miss out my new videos. And I'll see you definitely on the next video. Ciao!